Hey everyone, this is Dan from Hookah Pro. You might know me as Drunken Snow. This is my main man here, Power Surge. Uh, we used to co-host a metal show back in college and we're good friends. We're catching up on good times now that we both live near each other again. You might see him in a lot more videos to come. I'll get him on the forums, don't worry. Um, tonight's flavor that we're smoking is Tangier's Rangoon Sunrise. It's a flavor that I've actually had for months and I haven't tried yet. Um, still very juicy because it's Tangier's. Smell wise, I can't tell what the hell this is. Um, I get a hint of a cashmere type smell but not as potent as like cashmere peach or any of their other main cashmere flavors. Um, it's just that kind of cashmere spice with what seems to be very fruity, mm -hmm. you would say. Um, so, smells very good taste-wise. Exactly like it smells. It's Tangiers, guys. If you smell it, typically that's what you're going to smoke. Um, what do you taste out of it? Uh, I get a sense of, uh, it kind of reminds me of Celestial Seasonings Tea. Um, I remember having a and orange, a little hint of that in there. I can kind of taste a little bit, maybe a mandarin orange just because he brought it up. Um, it's very oriental kind of tasting, <laughs> hence the Rangoon. I thought I was going to get some kind of cream cheese concoction, but uh, that would have been kind of nasty, just like Froyo in your base. Put Froyo in your base sometime. It's amazing. Trust me. Do it. But. Uh, I mean, typical Tangier's clouds. I don't have my heat management down on it, so it's not thunder clouds like you see with multiple other users, but uh, good clouds. I'm still learning the ways of clouds. Yes. Unfortunately, up until last week was his first time with Tangier's with me, and before that, he is unfortunately a blue mist kind of guy. Quick lights. With uh, quick lights. Shame on me, I had no idea. Don't worry, I'm teaching him well. Um, but it's a very relaxing flavor in my opinion. It's, as I said, it, it kind of tastes very oriental to me. I don't know why, but ca what tastes like cashmere spice, um, it's very subdued cashmere if it is a cashmere spice. It just ties everything together so well. You get it on the inhale and exhale. I did put the saguk on to see if I could get any more flavor out of it. It killed the flavor going in. But you got a lot of flavor coming out. Um, amplified the flavor as it was coming out, but still cannot tell what this is. Um, it's strangely familiar, though. Yeah, that's the problem, is it's familiar. I would have to give this 8 out of 10. Um, it's something I could see myself smoking pretty much year-round, actually. Um, Definitely a good kind of warm weather smoke, but I could see myself smoking it when it's a little bit cooler outside. Uh, yeah, guys, I don't know what to say. What would you rate it? Seven and a half. Went right below you there. What would you rate it as of us, uh, you know, blue mist? It's the living crap out of it. There we go. I have turned another one on to the goodness of Tangiers. Get some. That's for you, Southern Pipe Man. Um, Definitely go pick it up. I got this from Five Star. I bought, I think I bought one of their like four pack sets and this was one of them I chose because I saw some other reviews by it. And even though they didn't get a full taste out of it, it was something that piqued my interest. So definitely go to your favorite Tangiers vendor, pick some up. Um, if you're on the edge, pick up 100 grams. Don't go full fledged 250 grams like I did. I don't know why, I just bite the bullet and always do that. But in the long run, I'll trade it off if I never like it. So look for the trade threads, but not for this because I'm keeping this and I'm smoking it. Well, this has been Drunken Stone Power Surge from HookahPro.com, your ultimate source for everything hookah. Catch you guys around.